Hey guys, it's Shapara. Welcome to my channel. Welcome. Thanks for tuning in today to my new subscribers. Welcome. Thank you for joining my channel. To my old subscribers, thanks for sticking in with your girl. I appreciate you so much. Today, uh, as you see from the title, we're going to be doing a wash and go. And I'm going to be using the Cream of Nature Cur Pure Honey Shrinkage Defense Curl Activator. And this is what it looks like right here. And I'm excited to try this. I've already washed and um, deep conditioned my hair. I actually used the Mish Beauty products. I used the Mish shampoo and I used the Mish um, moisturizing deep conditioner. I'll try to add a picture somewhere. So um, I'm done with that. And now my hair is wet and we're gonna go ahead and style. So this is my hair. The Mish Beauty products smell so good. So my hair smells just like that, and I really like those products. So my hair is detangled. I have my water bottle here if I need to re-wet. I have a little clip here to, to section my hair. I'm going to be using my wide tooth comb to detangle, further detangle, and my dimming brush to style. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm not going to be adding anything other than this curl activator to my hair. No oil, no leave-in. I just want to try the product and give it a, a true review, an honest review, just using it alone. Let's take a smell and see what it smells like. It smells like honey. It smells like Cream of Nature products, the Pure Honey line. It smells just like all the other products. So, let's get started. I'm going to section have my hair sectioned into two parts here. I'm going to just section this part and have two sections on each side. And again, I have my water bottle here that I'm going to spray, re-wet my hair with. I'm going to further detangle with my dimming brush. Let's add the product. It's creamy. Looks like this. So I'm just going to put it, rub it together in my hands. Again, it has that pure honey scent. And we're going to put it in my hair. And I can feel that it's very coated. All right, and there we go. And I did add quite a bit, so the next time I won't add as much. I think I probably put a little bit too much in that section. So we're going to take this out. There we go. So now this side is done. I'll give you a view. Looks really well, I think. Okay. And now I'm going to do the other side, and you can watch, and I'll play some music. to let this air dry because the directions do say let it air dry which I do anyway I always air dry my hair I hardly ever diffuse or sit under a hooded dryer I do eventually want to get a hooded dryer to sit under and let my hair dry just like this just sit under dry and just let it dry um, but that's an investment that I'll have to do at a later date so but for right now I'm gonna try to get closer and let you guys see it See what my hair looks like. And then on this side. Okay. 
gonna let it air dry and then I'll come back and show you what the results are. All right, be back soon. Hey Thanks. guys, it's Shapara. I'm back. It's actually the next day. Um, last night, my hair, uh, it did dry completely and I just put it in a pineapple when I went to bed. It was late. So now I'm here. It's midday. I know my hair is completely dry. It's still in the bonnet that I sleep in at night when I pineapple it. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys the finished product. I did like what I saw last night before I went to bed. So now that I've pineappled it, let's just see what we're working with. Okay, we're going to take all this off. Ooh, look at those curls. All right, let's see what we got. All right. Now, last night my hair was crunchy. I had a very good hold. Today it has softened out. I have worked out already. And, um, you know, it's like I said, it's midday. So it's soft. It's very soft. Even looks a little shiny. What do y'all think? I like it. Now I'm going to separate a little bit. See, there's a nice size ringlet right there. So I'm just going to separate that. I did get my hair cut in layers, and I love that. I will be doing a hair update. Things have changed on my hair a little bit. But I just wanted a little bit more volume and shape to my hair. So now I have that, if you can see that. Let's go on this side and do a little bit more. I like it. I like it. I hope you guys like it too. This will last me... I'm hoping three to four days. And then after that, I'll either re-wet it using this, reactivating the product and do a braid out or just pineapple it or, you know, pineapple it or ponytail it up. So for extra shine, I'm going to add some oil. I'm going to fluff just for a little bit more volume. I like it. Now what I'm going to do is use my favorite edge control and my favorite edge control is the inspire make inspire line by made beautiful the curly temple balm this stuff is amazing it holds down my edges and it smells it smells like juicy fruit i mean it just smells so good I don't use a whole, whole lot, so I'm not into all the edges. And I put it on my hand, I don't know if you can see that. I rub it in, and I just smooth it on my edges. I don't do a whole lot. I smooth it on the top to get away any flyaways. But and whatever's excess, I just rub it on my hair. And that's all I do. And then I'm going to brush it a little bit just to lay it down. Yep. And there you go. So this is the finished product. Really do like it. There you go. That's the finished touch. Thanks so much, guys, for tuning in today. Please like, please comment. I'd love to have a conversation with you all. And make sure you subscribe. Hit that subscribe button if you're new here. Um, I try to post a video every Saturday. Haven't posted in a few weeks because I've been really busy. But I do have some things coming up that I hope, I know you guys will enjoy. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, let me know what you think of this wash and go. Um, and... I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Have a great rest of your day and take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.